Hi guys, welcome back to another installment of Professor Charles' it's live, oh live, oh live, oh live. Welcome back to another installment of Professor Charles' it's live. And today guys, I guess I can talk to you guys about this. What have I been up to? What has your man's been doing this month so far? So, or maybe even last month. So let me just talk to you guys about what I've been doing. So apparently guys, I know a lot of you guys probably wonder like, man, you you <laughs> doing a lot of different things. So I got actually um a partner uh that goes by Jade that's like a co-host like to like the podcast idea I got going on. Uh we did one episode on Skype. Uh the thing is we have to figure out where is next and it's going to be called <laughs> like blur blur that um with the you know slash um, I, th I think it's a pretty dope, um, idea. It's been, it worked out with the very first episode. We have another one coming, hopefully this weekend. <laughs> I know Father's Day is coming up and I'm just like, oh, I don't know, man, you know, and I was just like, hopefully, um, something can happen this weekend. We've been trying to kind of like, you know, get together, like, and, and do something. And uh, like I said, this person doesn't even live in the state I live in, so, Shouts out to my Cali supporters, man, <laughs> or people that I work with, you know what I'm saying? Um, but it's, it's been interesting. Um, but yeah, we're going to do one on Mortal Kombat probably, uh, like I said, hopefully this week, weekend, I should say. Um, that's the one thing I've been up to, <coughs> excuse me. Um, the second number two, oh, number two, um, uh, number two, um, <clears throat> I recently decided to come out with something uh, a community a supportive community at that um and let me just say this i'm not dissing anybody i ain't saying everybody like this um a group of supporters like a, a support base peers amongst one another um with fellow black youtubers um because they always say black people can't come together i you know that stereotype is so like garbage Ugh, throw it in the garbage because there are people that are supportive and I, I took a risk with this um and the reason i say that is i used to make groups yeah literally i used to make groups i made groups on facebook i was a part of a group i left a group um the other group it started to become like crazy drama with the second group i was in the first group wasn't so bad the second group um certain people weren't on the best of terms and i, I kind of just say you know what i gotta let this go <laughs> the first group i'm sure is still around i'm just not the person that's in charge of it anymore enjoyed the memories i had out of it there there were some differences but at the end of the day there were some cool people that i'm still cool with out of the group so i don't personally have any beef <laughs> but the thing is um i decided i needed to come out with something for people to to kind of get together and stuff like that and i didn't make it super big so i know people are probably like hey man you didn't add me look I'm, I'm just trying to see test the waters you know what i'm saying some of the people i connected with um you know one of my friends shouts out to rain rain is someone i actually know out the group some of the other people we've connected and, and we you know like i said we're all doing different things with our channels I see that there people are genuinely supporting one another because I've been in groups. And let me just ho 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 let me talk about groups sometimes. Groups sometimes, depending on how many people you have, it can be the greatest thing ever. Or it could just be like straight trash. I'm not gonna either front like, you know what I'm saying? People bickering back and forth. But trust me, I know I used to do this for fun, a hobby. And I was just like, you know what, I want to do something different. And <laughs> shouts out to um, one of my supporters that kind of was like, hey, maybe you should try to do a group. And I was like, dang, you know what? I, I could. You know what I'm saying? And it took time figuring it out. <laughs> that was the fun thing about it. The first two attempts were terrible. I was just like, how on earth am I going to make a group? And it's actually the first black YouTube group on literally freaking Instagram. We're the first. <laughs> number one. You're number one. <laughs> But I, I've uh, been, like I said, connecting with people. Uh, like I said, even some of the newer people that I'm not familiar with, I took a risk with that too because, you know, sometimes you may not know people. But, you know, when people were genuine, when they 
you know, checked out my channel, said, you know what? I I think I see something that they could offer to, to make the group better. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we talk about different things that helps out, uh, like I said, supporting one another. I mean, I've been in groups, trust me, the Facebook, the Facebook groups, excuse me, are pretty much the worst, the worst of the worst. Um, and the reason I say that is because they, people are selfish. They're super selfish. Um, they only doing stuff for sub and they don't really check out the content. Now, let me just say this before people think I'm joking with this or, or being not being serious about this. There are a few, not many. <laughs> I still have a few that still rock with the channel. I just don't hear anything from them. I don't understand it. Another other person I think has like a couple different businesses going on. So I don't expect that from that person. Because I know you, you got about four or five freaking businesses. And who am I just like, you, you know what I'm saying? Like when they get back on here, I'm sure, you know what I'm saying? But um, like I said, the Instagram group is working. Um, and I wanted to do something because like I said, we always, they always say that we can't come together and do something together. You know what I'm saying? And I wanted to defeat that stereotype that yes, we can trust and believe we can. You just got to find like-minded individuals and people that want to push one another. And, you know, so that was something that I decided to do because they always say we can't come together. It's always drama, this and that. Absolutely not. <laughs> so that's the other thing I've been doing. <clears throat> that's number two. Uh, number three, uh, I've actually been getting better, like kind of like resisting, you know, certain foods that you like. <laughs> it's a challenge. Me going back to work, literally saying to myself, like, you know, the snack machine is temptation. It, it really is. It's, you know what I'm saying? Because it's, it's in your face. It's like, come on over. Come on over. Get, get some of these snacks. Nah. Uh, I bet usually I just get water now. Like yesterday, I just, like I said, I usually drink water. So that wasn't the problem. I think the snack machine was temptation because the snack machine doesn't have healthy snacks anymore. And that gets on my nerves. You know what I'm saying? Because they used to have these apple cinnamon straws. Oh my God. Them boys used to slap. <laughs> and when I mean they slapped, they were good. Like we're literally slamming good, slapping good, whatever you saying you want to, you know, and they don't even put them in the machine no more. Got this big old unhealthy pop tart in the machine, you know what I'm saying? Stuff that just gonna, you know, add on calories to you and stuff like that, or just are not super nutritious. And I just say to myself, like, I did, I'm doing good, guys. Day <laughs> two, <laughs> snack machine didn't even get anything. I was literally at lunch at the snack machine, but I didn't go and get anything. So I'm, I'm trying to work on myself, yo trying to work on myself believe that believe that <laughs> but uh that's what i've been doing just like losing weight that's i know people have noticed like man you you lost weight during the quarantine yeah you know what i'm saying i didn't eat myself away <laughs> i'm trying to i'm trying to get better yo you know what I'm, saying? I'm trying to get better and making changes and i already have but i'm just saying in general you know so i was just like hey what can i say <laughs> um Number, what's this, four or five, whichever number this is. Um, Pretty much the other thing I've been doing is just like getting to know um some of the other people um that I don't quite know that are a part of my community. Uh, it's been a, it's been a pleasure. It's been an honor. Um, I love that people are genuinely sincere that I've, you know, that I've come across in the community. Um, and I think that's a wonderful thing where it's coming from a genuine place, you know what I'm saying? From the heart, the soul, and your spirit. Um, and that's something I've been doing as well. Uh, also trying to get my sleep schedule back together. <laughs> uh, it's, it's been, it's been a pain. I, excuse me. And I'm just like, I've been trying, it works, but I still get up too early. Four o'clock in the morning, five o'clock in the morning. Um, you know what I'm saying? I think what I'm gonna do if I get up that early, I'm just gonna start reading books. You know what I'm saying? Like reading the books that I have. Like I've I'm reading a couple different books as we speak. Um also, yeah, as a matter of fact, let me talk about this. Um learning from a book that I read, you know what I'm saying? Uh pretty much and the reason for that is cause now I've created a whole nother community again. Um 
it's not a hassle. It's just that learning things I may need to learn. Um, and that's why I said to myself, um, I will be doing a live on my Instagram so I can get to know the individuals a little bit more. And I think that's a little bit more helpful so they can see my face. I'm not like in the shadows. Like he's in the shadows. Who is this mystery guy? <laughs> but I'm not, you know what I'm saying? So people could kind of ask questions if they want to join in on the live and they do it from wherever they at. That's fine too. So that's coming Saturday. So yeah, your boy been busy. <laughs> <laughs> the busiest blurred in the building, yo. But it's your boy, Professor Charles S. Live, guys. What have you been up to? Tell me in the comments, guys. And hopefully it's something that's, you know, further in your process. Believe it or not. Until next time, guys, your boy, Professor Charles S. Live in the building. Oh, yeah. Have a great day, guys. And I'm out. Moment high.